But you know it's true what they say. You truly are the best. <laughs> yeah, you know, it comes with time, experience, you know. Mm -hmm. I have always been known as one that dazzles, so dazzles. Not a big deal. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so when do you want to do this again? Anytime you want, man. Just name the place, the time, Tola, and I will be right there waiting for you. No, I mean. Salima, my name is not Tola. My name is Becky. Of course, your name is Becky. Tola. What else would I call you about? Tola. Becky. Tola. You don't call me Tola. You don't call me Tola. 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 Is Tola not your middle name? No. What? No, that is not my middle name. It's, no. That is not my middle name. It's your middle name. Oh, oh, shit. Then I'm sorry. I cannot believe I was intimate with you. But I oh, my you're... God. What did your friends say about what me? What my friends said? Me? What did they say? They said you're a womanizer. That you use women and throw them away. What does that mean? What does that mean? What does that mean? What does that mean? Hey, come on, that's harsh. What does that mean? Listen, no. What does that mean? What does that mean? Becky, come on! What? What did you even call? Did I even call Tom? You're a bitch. Can you imagine? Do I look like a taller? Do I look like a taller? you listen to me. I don't know who's, I don't, I don't, I don't know who's taller. Don't Believe me. Taller. Right. Right. You don't know who's taller. Let me tell you who taller is. That's your mother. Yes. You're a player. And nobody plays this game except you. You know what? You know what? When you become an adult, because obviously you're still a child. Call me. Taller. Who gave me answers to that? Who gave me answers to that? Dude, I can't believe you called her by the wrong name, man. Come on. Hey, shut up. I was there. I said it. I know what I said. Oh, my goodness. Tola. I mean, who the hell is Tola? That's, that's <laughs> just off. Hey, Stanley. Hey. I got those five copied as you wanted. Okay. Thank you. Oh, that's good. Yeah. Thank you, Ben. So, Ben, the guys are getting together later tonight. And, um, yeah. We're going someplace to have fun. Do you want to come along? I would love to, but I need to spend some quality time with my daughter. She just got back from boarding school last night. You have a daughter? I didn't know that. I have a very beautiful daughter. She turned nine last week. Really? All right, guys. I'll mm. see you guys. Mm. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. She's got a daughter. Oh, well. So, Stan, what's up? Stanley? Oh. Stan? Yeah? What? Yeah. You ready? Yeah. Let's go. Booyah! It's time to get the freak on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ben has a daughter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Going out tonight. Tell me, which one of your freaks are you going to be taking, and um, which one are you leaving for me? Chile, yeah. Chile. Uh -huh. Don't call them freaks, right? They are decent women. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And why can't I call them freaks when you can? Why? I don't call them freaks. Uh -huh. Come on, come uh -huh. on. Uh -huh. In fact, uh -huh. I, I had something serious I want to talk to you about, mm. and I want your listening ears mm. and your this. Mm. What do you want to talk about? What do you want to talk about? All right, all right. I know, I know, I know. Yes, you want to talk. You know, you want to discuss about the freak you're going to take out tonight. Yeah, 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 yeah. Can you yeah. Yeah. stop being stupid? Yes. Right. <laughs> let's talk about something serious, bro. Oh, serious. serious. All right, let's Come get into on. serious. Ah, focus. <laughs> Look, I'm going to get a kid. A what? A kid, a child. I want to get a child. And where are you going to find one of those? You know what? Let me ask you this. Don't you ever get lonely, you know? You feel alone after you come to work, you go home, or we go out hanging out, you know, all the girls and everything. When you sit home by yourself, don't you feel alone? 
You mean after the girls have left? Yeah. If it makes you feel better, after the girls have left, yeah. I don't know. I don't get lonely. No. I'm on to the next, like, you know. Chidi, 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 listen to me. Don't you sometimes want more out of life? I mean, like, yeah, we make a pretty decent living, but don't you want something else? Maybe a family or so? You're really serious with this, aren't you? Yes, I am. Wait, I don't get it. Where did all this come from? Okay, all right. Remember the last time we were in this office and we had to go out and Ben said he wasn't going because he had to go home to his kid? Yeah. And then we went out and James had to leave us because he wanted to talk his kid in bed. Okay, so where are you going That's with it. this? That's it. It got me thinking. Mm -hmm. Got me thinking that I had to put my life together, you know? Mm. And in case... Oh, okay, let me say it this way. Maybe if I had a kid, you know, projecting more responsibility, uh, a girl like Susa would take me more seriously. Mm -hmm. That's it. So basically, you're getting a kid to help you get to Susan. No, 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 no. That's pretty low. No, come on. Come I'm on. getting a kid to help me get to Susan. That's what you're doing. No. I look like to you? The guy who's about to carry my things. Come on in, come on in. This is my apartment. Um, the living room, of course. Uh, come here, let me show you around. Um, this is the dining room. In there, we have the kitchen. Um, here is a spare room, just in case we have a guest or something. Upstairs is uh, the bedrooms, right? I'm sure you like it. Come here, come here. So, your royal highness, where would you like me to put this? I guess I'll have a room here, don't you think? <laughs> She's a oh, Who is it? Come on in! Hey! Hi, oh. Susan. Hi, Judy. Hey, Susan, what's up? Hi, Stanley. <clears throat> Hello? Um, I wanted to see if I could get your screwdriver. Oh, my uh, screwdriver, right? Yeah. Okay, uh, would you... let me check in the kitchen. Uh, all right. Yeah. Don't you have a home? Hey, listen, you need to watch your mouth. I'm not about to be run out of my best friend's house by an eight-year-old, okay? I'm 11. Whatever. <laughs> a handful. Um, yo, I'm leaving. You can come and attend to your royal highness, okay? Right. <laughs> okay, bro. Yeah, Catch you later. So oh dear, what's your name? I'm Chelsea. Chelsea. Uh, I think uh, this will work. Yes. It's a little small, but... Uh, so where did you get this cutie from? Oh, my niece. <laughs> She's okay. my niece. Okay. Yeah. All right then. Okay. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Come on, let me take you upstairs and make you something to eat. Ah. Okay, here we are. Oh, 
Okay, this is your room. You know, given the fact that I'm just a financial advisor, this is what I can afford for now. You like it? Well, considering the fact that there isn't ten other girls in here. Okay. It's amazing. Then we're good. We're good. Oh, so um, get yourself settled, all right? Can I ask you a question? Shoot. How come you're not married? I mean, other than the fact that you hang out with a woman repellent. You seem like a really good guy. Well, uh, maybe I haven't met the right woman yet. But um, that's where you come in. <laughs> what do you mean? It's okay, forget it. Um, we'll talk about that later on. But make yourself comfortable. Uh, take your shower. I'm going to fix you something to eat, okay? Okay. All right. Um, you can put your stuff there. Okay, talk to you later. Chelsea. 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 If you're looking for monsters, you're usually under the bed. Where did you go? I went to get some water. Okay. I came to check up on you to make sure that you're okay, you're breathing well, you don't have any asthma attack. I'm breathing fine. All right, it's nice. You have your inhaler? Yeah, it's right here. Okay, let's go. So you have your water, you have your inhaler. Then, uh, good night. Good night. Wakey, wakey! Mm. It's morning. Mm. Oh, Monica, leave me, Monica, leave me, Monica. Good morning. <laughs> Can I have some blankets? No wonder he doesn't have a girlfriend. Hey. No. Oh. 
What? Stop! Stop! It's 8 o'clock already. Wake what? up! It's 8 o'clock. What are you doing up? It's a Saturday. Go back to bed. Come on, leave my room. Go back to bed. I want to sleep. Go back to bed. Oh, I'm tired. I got a problem. What problem do you have? Did you have a bad dream? No. You went to your bed? No. Then you don't have a problem. What's it say? I forgot to bring my underwear. What? You forgot your underwear? You mean you don't have any underwear? Only the one I'm wearing. Okay, go to your room, go back, go back. I'll come downstairs soon. Let's go. Uh, I'll go and get you some underwear. Come on, leave my room. Oh. Who is it? Stanley. Coming. Hey. Hi, Auntie Susan. Hey, Chelsea. I'm really sorry to bother you this morning. You are not bothering me. Okay, uh, I'm actually going to the supermarket to get something for Chelsea and I was hoping you would uh, yeah, keep an eye on her for me, please. Of course. Uh, uh, all right. Uh, for breakfast. Mm. Mm? Okay. Welcome, Uncle Stanley. You sent for me. Um, I, I got your undies, but I couldn't figure out which princess to buy, so I, I bought Spider-Man for you. <laughs> Spider-Man is cool. All right. Go ahead and try them. Thank you. Okay. do it, it's okay. You want me to act lost to attract women? Can I get some cookies? No. Why not? Because cookies are not good for you. But I can't work on an empty stomach. No cookies. Can we go? Then I want money. What? 5,000 or no deal. Wait. Are you... Are you trying to bribe me? Actually, you're the one bribing me. Really? All right. It's okay. Are you sure this is going to work? Well, I think it's going to work. You just have to be tight, be on your game, and make sure to lay it on thick. You understand? Okay. 
Yeah, lay on thick but not too thick, all right? Okay. Let's go. What do you mean this can be good? Mm, I just I brought my my niece, uh, my daughter. To oh, ho, hold on, hold on, hold on. Are you using your daughter or your niece to lure women? No. Is that what you're doing? How can I do that? No, we just came to Oh, you should be ashamed of get yourself. You are such a shame. So you gave me so much that you have to use your niece or your daughter oh, to get women. Come on, Becky, don't talk to me like that. I should that. talk to you how? Becky, you are Becky. a woman whore. We came you to should be ashamed! Shame on you! You see your daughter to get women! How? Casanova! Did I see you? you? She's too bad! What did you even say to her? So, is Becky an ex girlfriend? Was that so obvious? Yes, it was very obvious. <laughs> yeah. Look, I'm sorry I made you do that. Mm -hmm. It's okay. It was fun. Yeah, right. It was fun. Chelsea, how was school today? Great. Come on, put on your seatbelt. You stood outside for long? Mm -hmm. Well, 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 I'm sorry for keeping you waiting long. You ate all the food in your lunchbox. Oh. Come on, I'm trying to feed you. How would you feel if I went on a date with one of your teachers? You, sure, Miss Morgan. How did you know that? <laughs> because she's always talking about it to our friends at lunch. Really? Yeah. And the fact that everyone saw both of you staring together when you guys met at the school. Well, nice. But the problem is, who am I going to get to watch you? Okay. When I leave, I want you to be good. You hear that, sir? I'm talking to you, Rigid. You're not okay. <laughs> I'm serious, bro. And one last thing. She is not allowed to eat cookies no matter what she says to you. Look, it's fine. I got this. Just go on. All right, all right, all right, all right. How do I look? Good. Good? Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. I'll see you guys later, okay? All right. Be safe. <laughs> Oh, you can. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> hey. Hi. What are you doing here? 
I came to check on them and I found them sleeping. Aren't they cute? Yeah. They're adorable. How was it? It was good. Good. Well, I'll leave them to you now. Thank you, Susan. I mean, thank you for everything. I mean, you came to check up on them. That's admirable. You're welcome. Good night, Stanley. Good night, Susan. Let me walk you out. I'm coming. Hey. Hi. Um, can you spare a few minutes so we talk? Sure, why not? Come. Okay, thank you. Have a seat. Susan, I, I want to ask a huge favor from you um, with Chelsea. You know, she's going to be staying with me for a few months, and I, I just want you to help me out with her every now and then. It doesn't mean that I'm terrible at taking care of kids. You know, I don't know how to take care of kids, but I just need your assistance. On the contrary, Stanley, it's been great seeing another side of you with a kid under your care. Yeah, I'm beginning to feel like you're going to be a great dad. Ah, and that's where you come in. You know, um, I'm trying at this stage of my life to attain a certain kind of emotional stability. You know, and uh, look, uh, you know, Susan, I have decided to dish my promiscuous ways and, you know, try to be more responsible be more modest and that's why i brought chelsea it's just the first step in achieving these things like i once told you let's give you some time but then again i won't be surprised finding another lady heading out of your apartment oh trust you me. always do this oh trust me that's that's not gonna happen oh here we go again promises you never fulfill let's forget about that let's talk about chelsea fine I'm up for the job you're offering me, the co-parenting job. I'm up for it. <laughs> it's a job. Co-parenting? Yes, it's a job. Okay, that's good. Sounds good. You so can we, um, No, but we have a deal, right? Sure. Thank you. That's fine. Cool. All right. Say hi to Jesse. Oh, sure, sure. I will do. All right. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. You're really doing good with her. Yeah. I think she's kind of growing up. It's amazing to see how you step off the plate and take care of your niece. Yeah, my niece. <laughs> I mean, that's what family is for, right? Yeah, family is important. So important. I mean, the other day we were at the the mall and she was somewhere along the eye. I couldn't see her. I was looking all around for her and I thought she was missing and I, I was so scared it freaked the hell out of me. <laughs> well, it's a good thing that she has you looking out for her. She's pretty lucky. I think I'm the lucky one.
you finally got to kiss Susan. You're mad. <laughs> I'm proud of you. Proud of me for what? No, first was the beautiful, beautiful teacher from Chelsea School. Oh, come on. We just had a few dates. It's not like we, we're getting married. I know, but now it's the pretty neighbor Susan from down the hall. Now, that kid is really don't, don't doing her job. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. She's doing her job. Yes, she is. <sighs> okay. Whatever. Mm -hmm. Well, you know, she schooled you on how to cook. So this is hard. She schooled me on how to cook. Yes, I should. You cook in your house. Yes, I do. Man. You cook in your house. Come on. You eat my food every time. I, I give you food to so you. Tell me you school me on how to cook. No, this is this is just terrible. You have to school me on cooking. Yes, I have to. <laughs> Nothing much. Um, I need you to go on a double date with me. Double date? You know I don't do double dates. I know, but you do this for me. All right. Mm -hmm. How does she look like? Mm, let's just say she has a very good personality. Yeah. She has a very good personality. It doesn't yep. sound good. It is good. That means she's not beautiful. Dude, get ready. Let's go. Very good personality. You love her. That's when you describe a woman, she has a good personality. Mm -hmm. I'm in trouble. Mm. Come back, come back. Is there food in this house? Or do you cook to your house? Yeah. Is there any food in this house? Wow, 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 wow. wow. Nice personality, huh? That means she's a dog face. That means she's a what? A dog face. A dog face. <laughs> Come on. I mean, I'm not very hopeful when it comes to GD, but I don't want to be too cynical at it because there are a lot of beautiful women with nice personalities. Yeah, but what are the odds that you and your friend go out on a date with them? Like, you really need a woman. Like, I really need a woman. Where are your cookies? Go and grab them, let's go. I finished them. You finished eating what? All your cookies? The whole box of cookies? Yeah. What are you trying to do? You trying to get fat? Perfume stinks. Shut up. Guys, stop. Alright? She didn't behave your age, man. What about her? She's 10. She's behaving her age. Whatever. Hi, boys. Hi, Susan. Hello. Hey, Chelsea. Oh, Susan, I really do appreciate what you're doing for me. And I uh, hope you're good. I'm fine. It's no problem, really. Alright. Um, she's ready. She has. Um, Moving her bag and she has her inhaler. So, um. Got it. Okay, but I want her to sleep right after she watches the movie, all right? Stanley, she'll be fine. No. Yes, she will be fine. Can we go already? Yeah, and uh, Mr. Bank. Yes, Chelsea, behave yourself, all right? See you in the morning, okay? Yeah. This morning, be good. And, um, you, um, take care of yourself, okay? All right. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, Let's bye. <laughs> I have some ice cream in the freezer.
Chelsea. How do you like hanging out with your uncle? My uncle? Oh, yeah, my uncle. Uncle Stanley is great. What do you guys do together? A lot of things. I see. So why were your uncle Stanley and Jide dressed up tonight? We were going out to eat. It's who? These two women Uncle Jide met at the gym. Are you serious? Mm hmm It was a blind date. Uncle Stan didn't even want to go. But they didn't even do the grocery store trick. What grocery store trick? Chelsea. What grossy store trick? What grossy store trick? Uncle Stanley gave me 5k to act like I'm lost in the grocery store to pick up for me. Stanley, get dressed. Stanley will kill me. You're having a good time? Yeah. Where's that Susan? Susan? Mm -hmm. What is she doing here? Who is she? So this is what you have been doing with Chelsea. Using her to pick up women. Hi ladies. Hi. I, I'm Chelsea. Hi. Susan, no. Just calm down. I will talk to you about it. Susan, wait. You actually did it. Shut up. GD, you knew about this? No, 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 no. I had no idea. Stanley, what's going on here? Where can I get some cookies around here? Really? I will tell you what's going on here. Stanley here paid his niece to pretend to be lost in the store just to get the attention of the ladies in there. Exactly. This is not true, right? This is not true. Yeah, you're right. It's not true. Susan, can you just calm down? <laughs> Thanks for the meal. What, what did I do? What? Dude, what, I didn't do any. Come on. Listen to me. You don't, you don't have to do this. I can, you could have waited for me at the house. I will explain to you. Explain to who cares. Goodbye, Stanley. Can I get some cookies? You, you caused this, right? What did you tell her? What did you tell her? Fam, you have a situation in your hands. That's a crazy woman who's crazy in love with you. Because I don't know why this drama. Come on. Anyways. Why would she even come here? Like, she's not my girlfriend. Can you tell her where we're coming? That's a very stupid question. Oh, well. That's like some more chicken for me, you know what I'm saying? Oh, this is not going to waste. <laughs> to take me back now. Of 
cool stuff. Go to bed. to let you know that I I want to make this um... Oh, you're ready to bring her back already? What? I can't say that I blame you. I expected this. Expecting what? Nobody wants a problem, child. Just return her and we'll take her off your hands. Okay? She ended a call. What is she talking about? I don't want to bring her back. I want to make this permanent. What is going on there? She totally misunderstood me. I probably need to go to the office myself. Hi, Stanley. I'll see you later. Bye. She really hates me. Yeah, she does. Seriously? Uh huh. Idiot. 
Oh, where's my phone? Hey, let me check downstairs. It's not funny anymore. Hello, Stan. I brought a little cookie monster back, okay? Oh, look. Oh, but let me give it to him. Hey, 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 hey. Don't worry. It's like he has a new voice note. That's an invasion of privacy. You Will can't you check it. Keep quiet. Give it to... Keep quiet. Don't worry. Give it to me. Mm -mm. Mr. Okoye, good evening. This is Mrs. Okafo. As regards our last phone call, I'd like to find out when you plan to bring Chelsea back. Because um, we're ready to receive her. Thank you so much, sir. Have a nice day. Oh, you guys are back. Hey, my friend, what do you do with my phone? <laughs> she were going to take me back. What? Oh, you didn't hear me. What? Let me leave it up to you so you can hear me properly. You were going to take me back, weren't you? Look, Chelsea, you know what? Calm down and get off the chair now. Are you really going to take her back? Where is this coming from? Okay. Yes, I was going to take you back, but I changed my mind. You changed your mind? The door was open and I heard someone yelling. Is everything okay? Yes, Susan, everything is fine. No, Auntie Susan, it's not. Why don't you tell her? Yes, Stan, why don't you tell her? Tell me what? That I'm not his niece. Chelsea! I'm a foster kid! Uncle Stanley has been temporarily renting me so he could meet women! And now he's taking me back! <gasps> Stanley, is this true? Yes, it's true. Jide, Jide, what's your problem? Don't you ask me that! I warned you, didn't I, from the get-go, that this was a bad idea in the first place. But you wouldn't listen! So you knew about this? I want you to take me back to the group home in the morning. Look, Chelsea, let me explain to you. I don't need an explanation. I've been down this road before. I just need to explain everything to you. Uncle Stanley, I get it. I'm an orphan. I'm used to getting dropped back off.
April. Are you okay? No, I'm not. Do you really miss her? Of course I do. I mean... I... I miss her. So what are you going to do? What can I do? I mean, she, she, she couldn't even look at me or talk to me before she left. So that's it. You're just going to let her walk. You're going to let someone else adopt her. Really? She did. Even you, you didn't even want me to adopt her. So what did you say? Listen, you were acting quite selfish at first. And I didn't know you were this serious. Now that I know, I, I, I think you should do something about it. Just let her walk that way. No, you have to do something. You know, go there, play with her. Just, just talk. Do something. Make a move. You, listen, if, if you don't do something about it, you're going to regret this for the rest of what your life. What can I do? What can I do? After all, I've tried. I, I mean, I, 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 I've done my. Chelsea's inhaler. Big deal. You get it to her when you see her. You don't understand. She can't breathe without it. If she doesn't have it, she's, she's going to die. I, I don't, I don't, I don't know. Then we really need to get it to her. But I don't want to go there before they say like I'm trying to talk to the little girl. That should be the list of your worries. Feeling better now. Chelsea. 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 Your Uncle Stanley is here to see you. I'll come back later. Thank you, Mrs. Ukasha. You okay? Chelsea, I'm so sorry. I I, I didn't know I took your 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 inhaler along with me. I, I got to the house and I was doing something completely different and I realized that I had it in my pocket. I was so scared and I had to rush back quickly to give it to you. I'm so sorry, okay? I got a new one. Okay, that's good. Um, look, um, Chelsea, I just have a few things to explain to you and I want to see Uncle Stanley, you. I've been adopted. What? 
When? Today. Today? How? <clears throat> what happened? When you dropped me off this morning, Mrs. Okafo already had parents waiting to adopt me. So that's it. I mean, you've been adopted. That's that's it. Yeah. You're off the hook. Okay. I. I wish you all the best with your new parents, and I. I hope that you are happy. Thank you, Uncle Stanley. What is it, Stanley? I just want to say I'm sorry. I mean, I never meant to lie to you. I, I'm just sorry. Sorry for everything. What you did was really messed up. Gosh. I, I, I wasn't trying to hurt anybody. I was just being selfish. I was, I was stupid. I was, I was childish. And I'm sorry. So what happens to Chelsea now? She's been adopted by a different family. What? Yeah, Are you okay? No. I'm not. Well, whenever you want to talk, you can. You're welcome anytime. You can come in anytime. Me. You are so unbelievable.
Why did you invite me here? Susan, please sit down. Susan, I firstly want to start by saying sorry. Sorry to you for all the time I've behaved like a child. I know I've, I've, I've acted childishly, I've been irresponsible. Sorry for the whole Chelsea fiasco. I, I, I didn't mean to, I didn't mean to hurt you, I didn't mean to to behave the way I behaved. I'm, I'm just, I'm sorry. Susan, look, since we became neighbors, I've, I, I've, I've loved you, I've, I've liked you, you know, like, and I, I've, I've always had my eyes on you, but because I had this crazy policy that I would never date my neighbor, especially somebody so close to me, Susan, I, and I have a confession to make to you, the whole Chelsea thing. I, I, I wasn't truthful to you. Susan, I even used your name to get Chelsea from the orphanage. What? Yes, Susan. Stanley. I'm sorry. I, I, I didn't know what to do. I mean, they couldn't let me have a child. I, I, I was trying to prove that I could be responsible. They couldn't let me have a child without having a partner. So I, I had to lie to the... the, the the, 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 the head of the orphanage and said I, I said that we were we were together and you just couldn't make it to, 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 to pick up Chelsea. I was in my dream world just thinking that it was gonna work, you know, you you were gonna like Chelsea and you know perhaps Chelsea was gonna bring us together. I, I'm I'm sorry Susan. Oh, oh wait, wait this is about Chelsea because you want Chelsea back. No 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 no, no. wait listen so you don't truly really love me because you want Chelsea back, so you... I love you, I like you. I... Firstly, I want you, I want you as my partner. It, it, having Chelsea is just a bonus. Susan, believe me, I, I want you in my life. Susan, what better can a man wish for than having a woman like you as a partner, as a wife? Susan, please, just give me a chance, believe me. I wouldn't say it if I don't mean it. I'm not playing. It's not any gimmicks. It's not. I'm not. I'm not trying to take advantage of you. Please, Susan. Just give me a chance. Everything that has happened. I don't know. Yo, Stan. Yo, Jide. What's good? 
Good she's night. ready and she's waiting for you. Okay, I'm looking for my... Uh... Okay. Ah. I'm ready, let's go. All right. <clears throat> Tell her, tell her I'm coming, okay? Tell her I'm coming. All right. Bye. Okay, we have to hurry up. Take you so long to come get me. Don't you know I was the only one at school? Sorry, Your Highness. By the way, where's that? Um, he had to make a stop somewhere really important, so yeah. Where? I'll tell you on our way. Let's go. What's up, baby girl? What's up, bro? Okay. What's happening? Where's mom? Mom is inside. She's been waiting for you. Come on, let's go. <laughs> Come on, bro. Yeah. Let's go. Oh. Wow. <laughs> well, well, well. Baby. Mama. Yeah, you did a good job. I know. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. You don't waste the more. Child right there. That's my god child. Yeah, I know, but you just sit down and just watch. Yeah. Don't touch, alright? Okay. Okay. Mommy, I want to pray for you. Yeah, of course. Uh, we need that prayer because I'm waiting for this baby. Uh, this baby boy. Pray for baby boy, right? Let us pray. Oh Lord in heaven, we thank you for the Lord. We pray for a safe delivery. Amen. And the really love to have a baby brother. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. Jesus name, amen. 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 Now that, that's a beautiful prayer. Because you see, see that boy, we're naming him after his godfather. It's going to be called Olajide. No, Folajide. You're mad. Two. This is Stanley Jr. And just well, shut, your Stan mouth, Stanley shut your mouth. Shut your mouth. No, no. Stanley no, 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 no. Jr., right? Jide. And guess what? And guess who'll be introducing him to the strip club Who's when it's time? Mm -hmm. Daughter, you always don't watch strip club. No, I'm talking about the boy. The boy's gonna go to strip club. Ah! Ah! Doctor! 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 Doct